Monday, June. It's Bruce's first effort as a record producer, and he chose to put his money on the traditional authentic parang music, which he says suffers from insufficient airplay at Christmas time. Now you turn on the stations, you're going to hear soca parang, and you're going to hear soca. And it's squeezing out the little space that mm. authentic parang music Sorry. used to enjoy. So that's another reason for putting out the, um, the compilation. With live recordings collected over his three years of work with the National Parang Association, Bruce set out to produce music from several bands within the association, applying cutting-edge audio technology. The final product was this Hyarima Guardian of Parang CD and Cassette. But Bruce's promotion of the traditional Parang music is not limited to the CDs or cassettes. He has taken the music onto the internet, after linking up with the Computer Equipment Consultancy Planning Limited, a web page was set up. Palm will make its way to the internet by Christmas, so that on Christmas Day, anyone, any part of the world, Trinidadian or otherwise, wanting to listen to Palm could enjoy it right off the internet. Bruce plans to keep the website alive year-round with a link to the Tourism Development Company and by providing information on other local entertainment events. And as the site gets bigger, we would then have music clips from um, Calypsonians and other performers on that site. So we well. might even see Soka Monarch on there or Soka that Monarch, sort of thing, yeah. stuff like that? that? That is in the works. Soka Monarch would be the, the, the first project we, we, we'll be putting on the site. Uh, right. We can go into AB and it's going to be there.